if you missed the news, Walker Bueller, as we've mentioned, had a rehab appearance today. He was scheduled to go, I believe, 80 to 90 pitches was the goal for what they wanted to get out of him. He was starting at Rancho Cucamonga just to be a little bit closer. Unfortunately, um, he gets hit by a comebacker that bounces off his pitching hand. He kind of shakes it off. You could tell he's in pain when the time at the time of the comebacker. He ends up finishing the inning, but that's that. I think he made 27 total pitches. Um, Dave Roberts gave the update after. He left the rehab start for precautionary reasons. He doesn't think the injury is serious after taking a comebacker off his hand. Um, again, Bueller did finish the inning. So that was the news on Walker Bueller. There was a picture I saw that he had something taped up on his hand as he was leaving. Anthony, it's just a brutal bit of news for a guy that it feels like things are starting to happen. It feels like there's some positive momentum. And to have something fluky like this happen in a rehab appearance, just I feel for the guy. Yeah, I'm I'm glad that they're calling it precautionary. And that's kind of what I figured when, when he came out. Um, hopefully it's nothing more than that. I think yeah. what this does though, is it keeps him down for one more start. Uh, yeah. you know, regardless of when that would have been, maybe he would have started there again or somewhere in the minors again, but I think whatever, whatever the case is, it extends that timeline probably by another start. Um, which, you know, fine. Uh, yeah. you know, they're, they're going to get by fine without him and, and, um, you, you want to make sure he's built up. You know, you don't want him to come in. He can only give you four innings for the first couple of outings, right? Like you, yeah. you would like to see him built up a bit and, and you know, him doing it down there is fine. Um, but scary because I think the Dodgers are counting on that guy being a front end piece of that rotation. Um, and along with Glass now, probably leading them, you know, assuming everybody is, is fine into October. Yeah, and it's an interesting conversation because originally you'd say, hey, between Glass now, Yamamoto, Bobby Miller, hey, Walker, we just need you to slot in when you come back in that four or five range type of a situation. Obviously, Yamamoto now, another start, start that wasn't terrible, but wasn't dominant like maybe you'd expect. Bobby Miller didn't have his best outing last time. And so I'm not saying there's more pressure on Walker Bueller. I don't think any of that would affect him anyways, but it's just interesting that the situation that the Dodgers are in. Um, a, a quick note, because you mentioned this. The plan was that Bueller would pitch tonight for Rancho. Dave Roberts had said beforehand he would make one more rehab outing on Thursday. Again, with the goal that he was going to get up to 80 to 90 pitches. He did not. And so the goal was make one more rehab outing Thursday, and then they'll make a decision. Um, I think you you make a great point. I think hopefully he can pitch again on Thursday, keep that normal rhythm. But then whether it's at Rancho, whether it's at Oklahoma City, then you want to see him get up to 80 to 90 pitches. Then you probably have one more rehab start after that. And then we're talking about where does all this sit? So now, whereas maybe we were a week, week and a half away, now we're probably two and a half weeks away from Walker Bueller making his return. Again, rehab appearance in the second inning, had a ground ball comebacker that bounced off of his pitching hand. And he stayed in, finished the inning but was removed after that, not able to get to the 80 to 90 pitches. Dave Roberts did say precautionary his removal. If you want to believe Dave Roberts on an injury update, especially about a guy that wasn't even pitching at Dodger Stadium, uh, more power to you, I guess. Least, say. I'm not saying it's worse. I'm just saying I'm not like taking a sigh of relief because Dave Roberts said that tonight it was precautionary. I'm just, you know, it, at least they're not the Lakers training staff or injury update. Yeah people uh but i i think it's a very positive sign that he was allowed to finish that inning and get out of it and then got taken out yeah. if they thought it was something serious there's no way he would have thrown another ball yeah i'm with you i'm with you so laura